Mansoor, this Muslim man at Speaker's Corner, completely regrets asking this Christian this question about Islam and Christianity because he gets completely humiliated. Please watch until the end and stay tuned because you won't regret it. I said without explanation necessary. We no, no, no. were because, 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 because you don't understand. Because you don't understand. I'm not to you. I don't need an explanation. What, what would be the significance if he couldn't give you this? Okay, okay, okay. okay, cool. Can you now say in it, yeah, I make jihad in the name of Allah, Muhammad, and Jibril? Can you say that? No. Can you say that? Say what? Can you say I make jihad in the name of Allah, uh, Muhammad, and, and, and Jibril? Can you say that? What does it mean? No, on top of question. I, 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 no, 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 no. I said make, make jihad. You can't ask me to say you know, anything you know, no you know what jihad means? No. You know what jihad means? No. Tell me. You know what, you Tell know, me what know, the statement no, means. No, no, no. You know what jihad means? You know yeah, what jihad means? What is it mean? Oh, my <laughs> days. No, I'm let giving you an example. Stop running. He's essentially saying. Am I right? He's essentially saying. Can you please stop running? Am I right? Yes, you are, because you're understanding what I'm saying. But you don't want you're to answer the question. Running, yes. You know that if you answer this question, it's, it's, it's going to catch you out. So answer the question. Can you make jihad in the name of Allah, Muhammad, and Jibril? Yes or no? We don't say it like that. Yeah. Why, not? Why, why not? Why can't you? Because there are ways of stating if it's only from, like for example, if I say, I go in the name of my leader, for example, I can say that. But you are making a category no, mistake here. Yeah? No, finish, 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 finish. We are asking simply. Sorry, no, can you, can you get you the task task from there so I don't get caught. Yeah, he doesn't want to be in the camera at all. Come on, man, you're you're, you're smart and beautiful, aren't you? Doesn't matter. Oh, doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. He's beautiful for his wife or his girlfriend. He's beautiful for not for the camera. Not for the camera. Right. He doesn't girlfriend. want to be for the camera. Not girlfriend. No, wife, wife, wife. 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 Yeah, that's true. That's true. Right. Right. I, I like that. I like that. Good. Yeah. No. So now you can zoom in. Doesn't want to be for the camera. Well. So film, as, film as, we are, as we were saying. No, no, so we, so no, 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 he doesn't want to be on camera. camera. So you can record yeah, just the sound, so point away. He tends to go from that side, please. He has to cover up for his wife. My wife told me she doesn't want him to be on the internet. So, what we're discussing is identify without any Ambiguity. So, can you do that for all doctrines in Islam? Are they all there? They all there. That's a no, isn't it? So, so we want to know a statement from the scripture in which, in which, let me clarify what I want. No, but you still haven't answered my question. Look, I'm telling you, so I understand. Maybe you are having difficult understanding. Why are you throwing okay, insults? Why are you throwing insults? Why are you throwing insults? So okay. if you have difficult understanding, no, it's not understanding. I'm understanding you, but I'm understanding well, you, not answering my question. I don't think you understand it because you're not even letting me finish. What I'm saying okay. is, let him finish. Let him finish. we are discussing about the concepts of many gods, as you stated, there are many gods. That's what you said. That's why it started. There are many gods, the Bible says there are many gods. But out of these many gods, you don't worship one of them. You don't think all of them are true gods. You believe there is one God that is true. What we want to know is a categorical statement in which this is identified. In your scripture. John chapter 20, verse Identify. 28. Do you want to open this up and see what it says that? Are you going to listen to me? No, I'm listening to him. No, I'm okay, so you ask a question, I literally give you an answer. Oh, I'm so, not Okay, so, 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 so I want to make it clear you didn't answer my question. You told me to I sit here and I see like, okay, so if I don't have to, so, he does not have okay, to answer your question. So I don't have to answer your question. You're getting a bit no, moody, man. So, get a bit moody. So, so, so then there's so no further conversation then. No. Do you know why hold on, hold on, hold on, let me finish. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If you're saying if you're saying that, then then there's no point having a conversation. If you don't have to answer and I don't have to answer, your question. Answer your question. I didn't say I don't have the answer. You just did. The reason why the reason why. You are changing the topic. Oh, of the how is he changing? Wait, how is he changing? changing? Give question. you an answer. I how is he changing? A categorical statement. John chapter twenty, which? verse twenty-eight. Hold on, hold on. Do you have a categorical statement? I gave you. I gave you one. I gave you one. And then you tried to say, Let's "Hold on, it. let me finish." Yeah. What did you give me? Then you said, "Ah, oh, is ambiguous." Mm -hmm. And then I gave you a comparison that you did not want to answer mm -hmm. because if you answered it, that ambiguous? verse will no longer become ambiguous. I, I didn't even tell you it's ambiguous. <laughs> So what I'm asking okay, okay. you, so is that answer, you, okay. so, so the verse that, that I gave you, is it clear or is it ambiguous? Because now you just said you didn't Let's say it's hear ambiguous. The verse. Let's hear the verse, okay? You've said Start it so many times. No, 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 his camera just oh, came in it. Let's, Let's hear the verse. Yeah, yeah, Let's understand one of these verse. 
without any explanation, it tells you who the only true God is. Yes. Act of that criteria is faulty anyway, because your Quran mate does this all the time. All the time. Okay. Where yeah. does Isa so, so why, Bari, why, I'm the Messiah. Okay. Yeah, where does he say pray five times? Hold on, hold on, hold on. He's just reading his own Quran. That's uh, here you know what I mean? Matthew 28, 19. Yes. Yeah. And go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, Amen. baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son don't, and of the Holy Spirit, uh, just point teaching away. them. He doesn't want to be recorded. Singular name: the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Hold on, hold on, Act hold on, of hold worship, hold on, hold on, hold baptism. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Teaching them to observe all things that I have commanded you. Amen. And lo, uh, I am with you always, even till the end of the ages. Amen. Amen. Okay. Did you even see the word God in there? Did you? Did anyone hear the word God? Worship, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did anyone hear the word God in that statement? Did you? Did you? So, yes, in order to hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did you hear the word God? For God to identify Himself, He doesn't say He doesn't have to say I am, I am God, I am the true God. Your God started to sound a bit insecure. Yeah, say, like, oh, I'm the true God. I'm, I'm the true God. We know you're the true God. You don't have to worship me. Fear me. Let me finish now. Let me finish now. Let me finish what? My statement. No, go ahead. Let me finish now. Okay. Let me finish now. Okay, cool. So now, so, so now we sweep that under the carpet. Yeah, that's your yeah? question. Also. My God is not insecure that he has to run around saying I'm the true God. I'm the true yeah, God. Yeah, that's why he got God. killed. According okay. to your belief. Okay, yeah. that's he fine. He conquered death. Yeah, yeah. Okay, no, that's killed. fine. Well, your God oh, substitute. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Your God praise. Yeah, so right. now, the question that I asked you now, <laughs> that I asked you before that you didn't answer. <laughs> Tell me. Oh my days. Okay. Finish. Finish. So the question that I asked you, because it's similar to this question. Yes, yes. So now, are you able to go make jihad in the name of Allah, Muhammad, and Jubriel? And if no. not, why not? Amen. And if not, that why not? Blast, that would be oh, sure. Firstly, in that statement, uh -huh. there is no question about God. Wait, what? We are dealing with a categorical statement in which we want to identify God True God, only true God from many gods. That's how the discussion started. So let me remind you again. You believe in many gods, that's what you said. But out of this many gods, you don't worship one of them. You think some of them are false. And you think one of them or more of them is true. So we want a statement from your scripture in which the true God is categorically identified Father, Son, and Holy without Spirit. any ambiguity. It says Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Gods. The verse you quoted, it says, Go you baptize in the name of X, Y, and Z. act of worship oh, okay. right, to uh, wait. one name. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Does it even tell you even the word God in that statement? Of course not. It's but not guess what? Pragmatic. Guess what? We do have a statement in the Bible categorically identifying who the true God Amen. is. And it's going to go down Shall I now Amen. teach you about this verse? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Before I'm you... not finished yet. Let oh, me finish. finish in John 17, 3. No, 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 now you're jumping up. 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 Now you're jum
Remember the word. Categorically. Without any ambiguity. Wait, wait. I know. True God from Lame many Lame gods Lame which Lame are false. Lame. Right. We do have a statement in the Bible. The statement that you brought forth didn't even have the word God in it. Didn't have the God in it. But I am going to show you a verse from your own scripture in which. Which was still destroyed. Who else? Who else? No, that didn't sound not like an answer. Than, answer. Not other than no Jesus answer. Christ himself no telling you without any ambiguity who the only true God is. In John 17, 3. So you accept John? In John 17, 3, John. John 17, 3 John. which is acceptable by the Christians. That's so you cannot deny your scripture. Oh, we're not denying anything, bro. In that scripture, Jesus Christ is saying, the Father, the whole thing. You, no, it doesn't say that. This is eternal life. Amen. That they should know you. Amen. You. As what? The only true God. True God. No, let yes. Let's not do God. Yes. Yes. Let's and, 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 yes. And, so, two and, statements. So they should know you. They should know two things. Yes. Two things. Mm -hmm. Number one, the only true God and the one who sent. So they should know who is the only true God. Quote the whole verse. The Holy Spirit. The yep. the, uh, correct me if I'm mistaken. Can you quote the whole verse? I am. I am. Okay. Correct me if I'm making a mistake. That they should know. Are talking to them or are you talking to me? To you. Okay, so look at me. Correct me if I'm making a mistake. Okay, so. This is eternal life. That they should know oh, you and the Holy Spirit and the Son as the only true God and Jesus Christ whom thou sent. Okay. Have I made a mistake? No, you said it so far. Yes. Sorry? Huh? Have I made a mistake in the quotation? Yes. yes. That's not the uh, that's not the right. I have. Even though you're Italian, even though you're Italian, let me let me let me say it again. Uh, now this eternal life that the main. Oh, you this is eternal life Christ that they should sense. know you so and John the Son and the Holy Spirit as the only true God. I'm not making right. a conversation. Are you preaching? Are you listening? Do you have a question? Are you going to this question? You're preaching now. I'm not going to ask you. He's walking up the camera. The camera too long. I'm answering your question. That's not. How is that answering my question? How is that answering the question? When can you say I come to you in the name of Allah? Jibril and Muhammad. That's the question. Have I made him That's the question. Stop jumping. You're shuffling. Yep, that's right. You're first shuffling. Of all, first first of all, shuffle is yeah. mad in this corner from there. Dancing all, too much. Can you close up? Stop dancing, fam. I've, I've, I've let you talk for like I will, five I will minutes close now. up. Very good. Okay. I will close up. Close up quick. So now, I am quoting the scripture from memory, and my memory can be yeah. short lived. I can make mistakes. So correct me if I make a mistake when I'm quoting. Yeah? Okay. And I would like you to correct me. Get the verse out and correct me when I'm making mistakes. So. John 17 3 says, according to my memory, maybe faulty memory, this is eternal life. Okay. That they should know you, the Father, Amen. and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. You're have, I it. have I quoted it correctly? You're misquoting it, but you're jumping the I'm conversation. Asking you now. It's time for me to speak now. No, 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 Close up quick, uh, 10 seconds, and then I'm going to talk. I don't want you to turn seconds. Uh, I'm uh, going to speak 45 seconds. Uh, uh, if you don't want anyone to turn, I'm going to talk. Then I'm going to talk. Then you can walk away. I was here right. first, you walk away. Correct. You, you, you came correct. to me. I didn't correct. find you. You came to me. Manso's praying on Christians now, in the back again. And your time starts no. now. 45 okay. seconds. What is the 45 seconds now. And now he's not even listening. He's not even talking to us. He's not even talking to us. He's 45 seconds still going. He's just talking to us. He's 45 seconds still going. He's 45 seconds still going. He's Muslim. Your full advice is still going. No, he's a Unitarian. I'm done. No, no. Your full advice is still done. Ahmadiyya is Muslim. Amen. Okay. 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 Leave all those demons. First of all, first of all, I gave you about Church over five words. minutes Church to answer my words. question. Mm -hmm. Yes. I interrupted you a couple times. I interrupted you a couple times. As you interrupted me a couple times as well. So it's all fair. You never answered my question. You told me that you was going to answer. You said that you was going to answer. You never answered. And you never answered. You never even attempted to answer the question. So I am going to ask you the question again. Until you answer the question, yes, we are not going to move on. If you answer the question, then I would answer John. 
I asked, I asked the questions first, so out of respect, you should answer first. Okay. So, will you commit jihad in the name of Allah, Muhammad, or Jibril? And if not, why not? Good question. Irrelevant. Come back to my question. Oh, 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 no, that's a difficult question. That's a difficult one. I'm going to ignore it. There you go. How is that even? Your question is irrelevant too. Okay. Your question is irrelevant. Question is irrelevant. The reason why he's not answering my question. No, 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 no. He has the answer. Irrelevant question. The reason why he's not answering my question. Hold on, hold on. The reason why he's not answering my question because he knows the answer. Because if he says. Whatever answer, because he's going to say no, he can't. Right. Because the reason why he can't, because if he says yes, he commits shook. Yep, exactly He commits that. shook, yep. associating partners shook. with, with Allah. Ah, now you're going yeah, to yeah, mock him. Okay. Now you're going to mock him. It doesn't matter. Like I said, I don't care about the Arabic language. If I butcher, yeah. I butcher it. You get me? It's, 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 it's like the whole tongue. I don't care. Shame butchering okay. Yeah, no we shame. don't. He speaks Thank a different you. language. God bless so you, sir. God bless you. He doesn't speak it. He doesn't speak it. That's what I'm saying. That's why you can always ask what's the right pronunciation. Can I you can carry on. Hey, stop begging. Then finish. That's why he didn't want to, because I was going to use that in comparison to Matthew 28, Amen. when Jesus says, to "Go make disciples, making disciples in their virgins, going to go make jihad." Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. The one that's name. What, that's what Jesus said, and he says it all under as one. He never said it separate. So I don't want to hear, oh, uh, it's three separate gods. No, it was all under one, one name. name. One name. How the singular Islam? name of the huh? Father, Son, Holy Spirit. One singular name. One God. One name. Good. So now we've heard, we've heard his response. That no, 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 wait, wait. No, you no, haven't no, answered. No, no. I'm not done yet. I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. Are you going to finish? No, no finish. When you finish, just say I'm finished. Yes. He will. So you have no chance to interrupt. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so now, he went to... Uh, John 17, verse three. Verse three. Mm -hmm. That this is eternal life. That that yeah, and read five as well. Read five. That they okay, what may five? know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. Mm -hmm. I have glorified you on the earth. I have finished the work which you you've given me to do. Now, O oh Father, glorify me together with yourself with the glory which I had. Before the world. Amen. Yeah. Jesus okay. Is preeminent. Amen. Okay. So this, so John 17 shows you that Jesus predates the world. Amen. And if you predate the world, you predate creation. If you predate creation, you are automatically God. God. Amen. 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 Huh? Huh? Hey, jump, so, jump out so, of conversation, man. Oh, oh, A and B see, conversation. See, see yourself out. Oh, see hold, yourself on, out hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You see, hey, you see, you have hold it over there. Don't listen to him. Hey, heretic, heretic, go away. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, so angels are God there. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Can I ask you for a forbidden fire? Just, just, just leave him, just leave him over there, just leave him over there. Yes. So now Jesus had glory before the foundation of the world. Yes. Yes. Yes According or no? to the Bible. You don't yes have to no? believe it according to the Bible. According Can you not answer? Is it yes or no? It's very I, simple. I just want a yes or no. So no. When you ask a yes or no answer, I, I, I gave you an answer. He gracefully gave you an answer. Then I'm not being grateful. You give me an answer. So can you be as respectable? Can you offer me that grace? Be as respectable. The grace? Is it yes or no? Say yes or no. I am not interrupting him, but I'm making a side remark. When I asked him a question, was I you scolding? Did he answer? He didn't. And he didn't expect me an answer. No grace for him. No grace. Wow. The mercy of Allah, right? The mercy of Allah. It's me. Yeah, you're operating under Allah. I don't show any grace to people wasting time. Allah is the one who gives grace. Okay, so this verse is... Is it yes or no? 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 After he became a servant and now he was raised back up to what where he originally was. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Yeah. I'm waiting for the statement. I'm finished. Okay, okay. yeah, yeah. You no. can continue. You can continue. No, 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 no. He's not finished. Ask him an, uh, for an um, unambiguous verse. He's not finished yet. Sorry. Ask him for an unambiguous verse in the Quran as well, because he can't just be doing uh, tic tacs in the. In the Bible. Verse of what? Like, where did Isa ibn Maryam say, "I am the Messiah"? From his own okay. word, not not. Can you show word. me where Jesus himself, according Isa ibn to Maryam, the Quran, 
or Isa that he said that he himself is a Messiah, not not no one narrating, not Allah narrating, but Jesus himself Isa. saying that he he is the Messiah. Isa. Can you show me that in the Quran as well? So let's start Does with this question Quran? first. No. <laughs> no. Let's start with this question first. Mm -hmm. So if Jesus is stating and God is stating, whose statement counts more authoritative? Of course God. So if God says Jesus is the Messiah, you don't need Jesus himself That's saying I'm the Messiah asking. because the one in authority, in a higher authority, is God. So any sensible person would understand that. So let me return to my rebuttal to you what just, you just said. You just away from the so question, man. So, 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 so yes or no? Can you tell him not to interrupt? Hold on. Can you tell him not to interrupt? I, I apologize. Ask him where Muhammad is. Okay. So you didn't answer my question. question. Excellent. You didn't so answer my question. Uh, it's my turn to speak the way oh, okay. I am answering. He's answering. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, answering. He did it. So, That's not an answer. John 17, 3, we brought up, and the gentleman here That's begging up, to authority. Right? Even though he's not a, identifying as a Muslim, correct? Yeah. Very we brought up for a reason. Authority. Because in this is a categorical statement from Jesus, who you think is God. He himself he says, says, says one true. He himself says who the true God is. When I asked you in your belief in many gods, who is the true God then? Where is it identified? You don't believe in many you gods. You brought a verse in which the three names are mentioned. I will give you one name. You Please, no, your straw man, it is one no, name. Uh, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want him to straw man. I know, man. I know, I know. I know, he's a professional right. person. He's right. So, so, you give a verse in which there is not even the word God present. Go and baptize in the name of the Father, the Son, and whatever, right? Holy Spirit. Amen. Yep. It doesn't even say categorically that they are one true God out of many. It doesn't identify. It simply says, when you want to do baptism, choose these three in your name. Yeah? When you want to use the name, this is the three you will identify. It doesn't reject that there could be others who are true gods, and it doesn't identify that these three that are named here are true gods. Right? It only says, go and baptize. Instead, I brought to you from your own scripture, which is binding to you, oh, this, uh, in John 17, 3, in which like it without. seems Jesus huh? Christ himself, are you listening? Like Jesus Christ himself is saying, that the only true God is, the only true God is, is not the Holy Spirit and the Son and the Father, as I misquoted, and you dared not correct me, because if you corrected me, your game was up, you didn't read it out loud. Me, if you didn't correct me, your game would have been up anyway. Why? Oh, it's because, not because no. listen, it's no, oh, a no, lose no. lose situation. You know why? Because in that categorical statement, Jesus identified one person who was the only true God. Because the Father is not three persons. The Father is one person, unless you believe he's three persons. Like the brother earlier on thought God was one person in some form of Trinity. Remember the discussion? So if you believe the Father is one person and Jesus is saying the only true God is the Father, so now we have a categorical statement identifying who the true God is. It's not the three personal being called God, the Trinity in Christianity. It's one person and not Jesus being that one person, not the Holy Spirit being that one person, it's the Father, which the Jewish people already said was God on one and only. So now we found a categorical statement debunking oh, time in your sea. belief. This is not the belief of Jesus Christ, because he identified out of all these false gods, the only true God is the Father. Now let me give you some similar Can we answer verses. You can, can we answer? 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 Let's focus on what you just no, quoted. No, 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 no. He said Paul. Focus on what you yeah. just quoted. Paul he said says, Paul. Okay. Paul writes, okay, thank you. I solemnly no, 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 no. tell you. You know what I mean? You know in what I mean? the presence of God yeah. and of Christ yeah. and his chosen angel, angels, three things entities identified. So according to Paul, because he identified 
I solemnly charge you in the presence of God and of Christ, <laughs> Jesus and his chosen name, angels. So that must be the one true God. Or, or is it where Jesus speaks when he says, the son of man, I'm now giving you the crux, it's a bigger passage. He says, comes in his, the son of man comes in his At glory point, and the glory of the father and the holy angels. This is in Luke 9, 26. Matthew yeah, you're, you're, you're jumping too much. No, 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 so now, right. hold on, hold on. So you now I'm going to talk. I don't care. 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 No, no, you're just talking too much. You literally won't let him respond to you. You're not letting me respond to you. You just want to chat. All you're trying to do is try to bombard me. One point at a time. 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 Okay, cool. He's made one point. So, so, is what he says. The father, he says, the father is the true God. He says, he says, the father, he says, the father is the Right, right. But, right. but hold on. But when the Jesus father Jesus. worships the son, yeah. he doesn't want to go there. No, he, he doesn't want to go there. Can you go, there. To Can you go to Hebrews 1, please? Can you go to Hebrews 1? Go to Hebrews 1. Can you go to Hebrews 1? Hebrews 1, 6. Can you go to Hebrews 1? Hebrews 1, 6. Can you go to Hebrews 1, 8? Can you go to John 20, verse 28? Can you go to Hebrews 1, 8? As you guys can see, when these brothers in Christ bring up these questions to Mansoor about Islam, after using his question against him, he completely runs away and says that that is not a fair question. You see, this is what Muslims typically do when they don't know how to answer a question, just like their false prophet Muhammad. For example, whenever you go to any Muslim and you bring up the child bride marriage between Aisha and Muhammad at the age of six years old with a 60 year old man, they will usually say something along the lines of, well, at that time period, it was okay. And then if you don't like that reasoning of them justifying a PDF file, then they will proceed with, I don't know how to answer that question. You're not being fair. Because this is what Muslims usually do. They commit the act of tzakiyah, which is lying for the purpose of furthering Islam. This is nothing new to their faith. In fact, we see that this is a very common practice all throughout history. This is the reason why when Muslims go to new countries, they end up 20, 50, 100 years down the road, end up dominating the whole country and force everyone to accept Islam with Sharia law. So this is very questionable and it should make you think, the Muslims we see in the West that are very nice, are they being nice because they're westernized? Or are they being nice because they're trying to gain our favor and force Sharia law down our throats? 50, 100 years down the road. That's something for us to think about because we see Muslims have created this dilemma of Islamophobia around the world, where if you speak anything anti-Islam, you're considered Islamophobic. So it's a very, a very scary world that we live in, but let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. Am I reaching with this? Or is there some kind of basis or foundational evidence for this? Uh, for example, when we look at the Quran, it teaches you to slay and murder all the unbelievers. This includes the Christians, the Jews, the pagans, and anyone who's not Muslim or follows the Islamic faith. Versus when you look at any other religion in the world, it does not, for, it does not tell you to force murder people in order to come to Islam. That's the difference between Christianity, Islam, and every other religion in the world. Please go ahead and comment your opinions below. Let me know what you guys think. Please smash that like button. Subscribe, turn on notifications, and I hope you guys have a blessed weekend.